44 is Ariel Salk is live downtown now. And Ariel, what's it looking like? What's it sounding like? How's it down there? It's really starting to heat up out here. You might be able to hear the music behind me. It's Careless Whisper. Fun fact, one of the musicians in that band works at our office. But people are sitting out here. They've got their lawn chairs out there eating food that smells so good. Everything you want and more at a Live After Five event. I spoke to some folks earlier today, and they said they were so excited to be here. Pre-COVID, you know, I, I would come all the time, but so I'm excited. <laughs> Tonight kicks off the first Live After Five event for the season. Caden Crump is new to the city and is excited for the event. I am interested. Um, I just found out about it, and it seems really cool. I'm hoping to maybe meet some new people here, just kind of get the vibe of the city. The event was canceled in 2020 and in the spring of 2021. Last fall, Live After Five came back. Director of the Business Association says events like these are important for local business. We had a drought of activity um, during COVID, and all of the downtown businesses need these uh, festivals. They need all of the festival goers who come to these free events to support them. Andrea Frank has lived in Baton Rouge for 15 years, and she's been missing the fun. Just the music, um, and then seeing all the people. I miss that the most, I think, is just being able to see people out enjoying themselves. And if you missed tonight's event, Live After Five will be lighting up downtown for the next six Fridays, except for Good Friday. So, uh, yeah, you can come back next week if you miss tonight, but don't miss tonight because it's going to be a really good concert. <laughs> Dozens of vendors are out here tonight, including food and art, so it should be a lot of fun. Later this evening, Cowboy Mouth will be playing, and this event will be running till 8 p.m., so there's plenty of time for you to come out here and have a little fun yourself. Reporting live in Baton Rouge, Ariel Salt, Fox 44 News. All right, thank you, Ariel, for that tonight. Well, resources are pouring into the 